I decided to share this video of me just making some art and just talking through some of the emotions that I wrote down in my journal. This is a video that I actually made a long time ago, but I just wasn't in the mood to upload it because I was just suffering through a rut and just not feeling very creative or inspired and I just didn't feel good enough to be creating let alone just sharing anything on here so I finally got out of that rut and I'm feeling inspired again to just share it even though I'm really not a great artist through having a conversation with a friend I realized that I had imposter syndrome which is just basically not feeling that I deserve anything good or not feeling good enough and so that just explained why I just really didn't want to create anything let alone upload anything on YouTube or any of my socials just because I didn't feel good enough and so then I was just self-sabotaging myself in some ways neglecting the routines that I know are good for me and just staying in bed most of the day and not really doing anything quote-unquote productive well you know I didn't really want to be seen but I know that these are all lies and I just have like an underlying pattern of unconscious beliefs that are I guess deeply rooted within myself that I have to work through because these deep-seated beliefs really are gonna get in, my, in the way of me achieving my dreams and my dream lives and just being on the other side of that I realize how much I have achieved and how much I'm grateful for everything that I have in my life and yeah I'm just like I can't let my own unconscious beliefs like get in the way of me achieving my dreams and so it was really really has been a really eye-opening experience to just go through it and to I guess in a way label my feelings and my emotions I usually don't like labeling feel just because I feel like I always felt like it kind of will make it more real and so then I guess it's just a fear that I had that if I label it I know what it is then I become that thing but I don't become that thing that labeling it really helps me to be able to just get over it be able to accept it and then just work towards you know working through it and being the best version of myself again take better care of my mental health and creating art is one way for me to just process my emotions and to just be in the present moment without any expectations although this is something that I am just always continually working on with my art not placing any expectations expecting it to look a certain way or for it to be perfect because you know I am a bit of a perfectionist and I always want things to be perfect but I've learned and am continuing to learn to let go of that idea and to just create even if it's bad it's not really bad you know it just is so making art just teaches me to just create just for the sake of creating and not creating for it to be perfect because i don't think anything is perfect and if i go into life with that mentality then you know it really is not a healthy way to view at the view the world in my opinion so you know making mistakes and working around those mistakes but like bob ross says you know it's not a mistake it's just a happy coincidence 
that's the kind of mentality that I'm trying to adopt in my life right now to just accept everything as it comes and to just be present through it all. So yeah, that's just what I just wanted to share with this little art vlog and I really hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for being here and I'll see you in the next one.